What's good, YouTube? How's everybody been? I'm CEO Nan. I'm back like I never left. Today, I have another unboxing for you guys. The Air Max One by Day Colorway, aka the Poppy Dudes. But y'all know my model by now. I don't come here to talk for 25 minutes. I come here to show you guys these sneakers so you can decide whether or not you want to pick these sneakers up or not. So let's get down to these sneakers. Here we have it. Air Max Ones. Eh. Bow. Here you guys go. Let me get the other sneaker off the box. Ugh. Get this box out of the way. I'm going to sit this here just for a second. What do you guys think? Honest opinions. Let me know down in the comment section. What do you guys think of this uh, new Air Max 1 that just got released? For me, sick. I love the colorways. I've been waiting for this Air Max to come out for a while. Um, I actually ordered this from uh, sneakers and stuff. So I know that's in Europe. So I'm not sure if this has been released in the United States or not. But I couldn't wait. They did a restock on sneakers and stuff. So I was like, F it. Let me just grab it. I went on there and was able to get my size 10 and a half. So here you guys have it. Uh, first of all, first impressions, I love the colorways. I think it's dope colorways. Uh, you've got your suede on here. And um, this, I mean, I don't have a lot of Air Max ones, but this pair right here, the leather up front, it's like a tumbled leather. It's really nice leather on there. Uh, you got the suede here, right here. Give you guys a nice close up right there. You got that blue leather check. Um, down here, you got that red air bubble down there. This is a clean colorway, you know what I mean? Y'all know me by now. I'm not a huge fan of black sneakers. Just doesn't do it for me. So when I see a white Air Max with, a, with some color to it, I love that. Um, I was told, now don't get me, don't go looking up. I'm not sure if I'm correct or not. But I was told that Tinker, who created the Air Max One, um, he designed it after a building in Paris that was called Poppy Dude. There was a building out there. Like I said, Google fact me. Let me know if I'm wrong or right. But he saw the building in Paris. He was inspired by it to bring the Air Max. And I guess um, he had seen other Nike sneakers with the air bubbles in them, but he wanted to actually show the air bubble. So I think the Air Max is the first sneaker to actually show the actual air bubble. Like I said, I'm just going on with which I Googled five minutes ago. So I could be right or wrong. I don't know. Let me know. But that he got the idea from the building in Paris. And on the bottom, I didn't show you guys that yet. This is sick. I think that's one of the best parts of the sneakers, that bottom right there. Just cool, dope colorways. Uh, I love the lines that they put on this sneaker. You got the red lines going around. Then you got the green and the, uh, the green, I'm sorry, the yellow. And then you have the green up front right here. Just dope for me. I like the lines. I love the craftsmanship on here, the leather. Nice quality. Uh, inside, it's white, but you got that blue Nike Air inside. So here you guys have it. The Air Max one by day. There is a by night colorway. That's an all gray, gray suede. I think the toolbox is gray as well. I saw that, but you guys know me. I prefer the white, but the by night one isn't bad either. Um, as you guys can see, I've been doing a lot more Air Maxes. I've actually sold a few of my Jordans. Uh, as I'm getting older, my, my taste in sneaker is changing, so I've been definitely doing a little more um, Air Maxes. You know what I mean? I have here, these are my Air Maxes I do have. The Air Max one, the Obsidian colorway, uh, the Aqua colorway right here. Um, down here, the Red Anniversaries, um, the Royal Blue right here, and then I have the Watermelon right here. So like I said, I've been definitely getting into my Air Max collection. I also have 98s, Air Max 270s, 97s, uh, Air Max 93s, Air Max 180s. Uh, let me guys know down below, should I do an Air Max video? This is my collection for Air Maxes. Like I said, I'm definitely digging into Air Maxes a lot more. Um, I also have those um, new... Let me think what they call. Oh, yeah, the new Prestos, the acronym Prestos that came out, those will be here this week. So I'll definitely have that review coming for you guys. Um, I think my next Jordan I'm going to grab is probably those South Beach 8s. I'll probably grab those. Those won't sell out. Hopefully not. Um, those foam pods, the Habanero foam pods, I'm grabbing those this month as well. So, like I said, here you guys have it. The Air Max 1 by day colorway. Like I said, come on now. This is a clean colorway. More of a summer shoe, but you can pull it off in the fall too. You know what I mean? Uh, let me see. Oh, up here they got the all white Nike Air right there. I know you guys can see that. Like I said, my favorite part of the sneaker is the bottom of the sneaker. I love that. What they did with the sole of that sneaker. Just a dope collab. I think it's dope. That's how I feel. Uh, one more look for you guys. And there you have it. Let me know if you guys were able to pick up this sneaker. I know on StockX the resale value is going down a little bit. I think these cost maybe $150. 164 to get them shipped over from Europe for sneakers and stuff. So if you guys are ever trying to get sneakers from overseas, definitely check out sneakers and stuff. They ship pretty fast. It takes about two days. That's where I got my um, pretzels that are coming. It takes about two days to get here, actually. So it's not bad. Shipping was about $14. 
So I thought that was pretty good for being shipped overseas two days. I've ordered from um, Foot Locker and it's taking a week and they're in the United States. So I don't know how that works. You know, I mean, overseas takes two days. Foot Locker's in the States and takes a week to get here. But like I said, I appreciate you guys. We're at 1,400 subscribers. If it's your first time watching one of my videos, please do me one big favor. Hit that subscribe button. Make sure that notification button. Follow me on Instagram at CONAL23. And as always, until I see you guys next time, I'm Ghost.